Welcome Extreme Home Arcade owners. This is a tutorial video how to set up your Xbox controllers and the Sony PlayStation emulator. I'm in the main folder. I'm at the PlayStation uh, part of it. So I'm going to hit player one. That's going to bring me into the PlayStation folder. From here, I'm going to hit the player one coin. It's going to bring a menu up on my right. And from here, I'm going to open Duck Station. So player one. And from here, it's going to bring up this menu. And from here, I'm going to hit settings. And then on your left here, you're going to find controller settings. And then you're for obviously for PlayStation, you're only going to have port one and two. You're only going to have two controllers from here. I always make sure analog controller dual shock it's on. And then from here, you have all your button mapping. So basically from here, it says up, down, left, right. Um, so this is for D-pad. So basically for, I have my player one controller. So I'm gonna do left click on my mouse. Now D-pad, up. Um, and with PlayStation, sometimes like your Xbox controllers will come up and show differently. Um, and that's all dependent too on like your panel. Like if you have a Tron stick and stuff, like it, in this PlayStation emulator, for some reason, it'll recognize the Xbox controllers as, as different ones sometimes. Um, so don't worry if it comes up differently on here. As long as you get your controllers programmed in right, you should be ready to go. Um, see, this one was actually controller one. The one I was actually using was controller two. Um, so then again, from here, you can do all your bindings. So click down and do left right so again from here you're gonna do you can do select start you know it's just a matter of clicking and then hitting the button on your controller and you go all the way down you you can do, even do your uh, you know your analog joysticks there and then from here save profile and do I always do Xbox one and then obviously for two you can do the same thing that I was just showing you by clicking and up down and you can do that for everything again for playstation 2 i should say like triangle triangle is actually going to be y cross is going to be a circle is going to be b and square is going to be your x button those are those are what i originally map it to you can change it to whatever you like again when you're done with everything save save profile xbox 2 that one was for after that, you're all done, you can exit out, and you're ready to have fun.